Man, they say Slim 400 is dead. Come on. Nine shots. Nine shots. That's how many you took? Walked it off. God, God, me. That was too easy. It ain't fucking easy. <laughs> Crazy motherfucker. Yo, y'all know what it is. Y'all know that ain't. Early this morning, folks. I woke up to some news that Slim 400 was shot and killed, ambushed in his own hood. Now, if y'all not familiar with who Slim 400 is, YG, he used to call himself YG 400 when he first came out with the two didn't boo that. And um, he was still kind of with the jerking phase as far as YG. Slim 400, I first started hearing about him in like 2015, probably a little bit before then, a little bit after. He had a little braids in his head, and I was looking like, this got to be YG, homie, because he got 400 in his name. He ended up cutting his hair. He started to do, the, he tried to do the rap thing, but he was more of an entertainment personality type of guy, in my opinion. Um, not too long ago, he got shot nine times in the same hood where well, he unfortunately lost his life. If you look at this video that I got right here on the screen, that's some of the crime scene. He was supposedly killed somewhere up there where you see um, the police, where the police cars are. And it's just sad that he also died to, due to the unfortunate circumstances of being in your own city in your own hood. We've seen this time and time again. Actually, in this live video right here, he said he was doing it for Dolph. He was doing it for Dolph, and he ended up dying in almost the same manner that Dolph was killed. FBG Duck shot and killed in his own town. Now it's actually starting to make it seem like those DJ Vlad interviews that hypnotized with hatred. Like they started to actually mean something now when you really think about what Boozy was saying. YG 400 wasn't the richest. I'm pretty sure him and YG was on good terms. YG would have did whatever he could to save his homie life. But at the end of the day, you got to stop blaming people around somebody who's successful and hold them accountable for being in their city. And then when you can, and it's like you don't want to chastise anybody for being in their hometown, but everybody knows, man. You, when you get a little money, you got to get out, especially if you were shot nine times before. Um, this don't seem like it was just a random act of violence. It seemed like some some type of scenarios led up to this. They say he was backdoored, but nowadays when everybody died, they say he was backdoored. Get in the comment section and let me know how y'all feel about this. And actually, what was y'all favorite Slim 400 song? I never heard any music from him, though, but um, I'm gone.